All right, so today on the wonderful, lovely Snake Gaming Metarox, um, basically we're gonna be playing some Planet Zoo. Um, now my, I've also got Planet Coaster. Now I don't know if I did record a previous episode with the voice. If not, I'll probably end up having to redo that one. And Planet Zoo, I'll probably do first, anyways. So we'll probably end up doing Planet Zoo and Planet um, Coaster, but we'll be doing franchise mode. Um, for today, so let's get started. Um, now, I'm not going with Sandbox or Challenge. We're going to go with Franchise. This is where we have to be connected online. Um, let's just, just go with GMR Zoo, I guess. New rewards claim. Okay. Go with temperate grassland, um, tropical grassland. Um, we could go like tundra, um, tundra, tundra. That was that considered tundra. I think let's go with the grasslands. We'll go with North America. Difficulty. Franchise management. This one is going to be called um, North. Um, no, we'll call it N R. We'll call it N R Zoo. I don't know. All right. So, happier guests spend more money. Okay. So, here's what here's what we've got available to us. So, franchise mode, I've seen people play this. You know, I've watched a lot of YouTubers, a lot of, um, a lot of people play this before I even got my hands on it. So, don't mind me, but I kind of know kind of a little bit of what I'm doing. Not really. I've never really experienced the game itself. Itself. Inexplanatory. But, so, what, French, what we're gonna do is Zoo's are typically going to need somewhere that they're going to have. But we only have about... Um, we only have a lot of finances to get. So we need essentials. So... So we need a staff room. So let's put... So basically, we're going to put the staff room... We're gonna need some of these stuff. So, what I want to do is I want to. I always like to tend to put things. Put the hide the staff room. Okay. Um. Okay. Let's go with. We're gonna just gonna put the workshop here. Keeper's hut and vet surgery at least. Okay, everything else I'm not going to start right away. Um, and we're also going to need that trade center, I think. So, so there's already 30000 already spent. So, we're going to let... So, before we do um, animal trading... Okay, so how much, um, we only have about conservation credits, we only have about 200 conservation credits. So what we want to do is go by price, but we also, um, let's see, how much prize winnings? 
Um, a Western African lion. So... So we got the common warthog, the Indian peafowl. I'm not, like, conserva- like, the common warthog. Um, we do got- actually, we do got a- two common warthogs. We do have a common warthog here as well. Arrives in 22 months. So we got basic longevity gene is not much. So we could go with that one and this one here. That one has good genes. This one does not have... Um, hold on. Nope. This one here. Zoopedia. Um, it looks like... Common warthog. Um... Okay, so the common warthog, um, natural habitat, okay, um, species data, life expectancy, um, dominance, male fights for right for males, males have rank in group based on age, promacus confident, um, male bachelor group size, Excluding juveniles one to four, um, female bachelor group, um, one to seven. So, we, let's do. Let's just get one male and one female. So, so the common warthogs that um, diet is hay. Um, but they can also be um with a lot of these other. Compatible species. So we might just start with a small thing and expand out. And getting like the African buffalo. Getting the springbok. The stable antelope. The black wild beast. The common ostrich. And plains zebra. So we might be able to do that. Um, so let's start with the common warthog I guess. So. Animal trading. Oh, what? What? So we got this guy here. No. Okay. So. So, I guess, I guess I should have gotten it then. Okay, so it's size gene and longevity is not that great. Um, but another male common warthog, I guess. Oh, that one has about 55. And that one... That one's a lot better. So these two... Boom. And adopt you for sure and adopt you for sure they're gonna be both conservation credit spending cut so now we've got two common warthogs we're gonna start with that um, so, let's go with habitat. Barriers. Um. Okay. 
let's go to um, animal trading, I guess. Um, no. Zoopedia, common warthog. Um, I gotta typically look at tropical grassland. These guys are, they like to be in track grassland so that we don't have to really change too much. Landing requirement about 290 meters squared. So about that roughly. Um, we'll go with, we'll go with about 300 for it. So bears, I think let's just go. Um, let's do this. So we don't, they don't need to like be like, it needs to be all flat. So I think let's just try to find a brick. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually have them sit off over here to the side here. Length. Let's increase that length there So we'll see how that looks. Um, yay. Um, I'm at that gate, but All I'm going to do is just put a couple of windows here. Okay, I don't know if they might need larger space. So, okay, so let's go with animal trading. Um, animal storage. Okay, um... No.
Christmas hunt. So, animal trading. And our zoo. Okay, so that means now we should be able to um, construction. Um, Architecture, facilities. Because that should be staff path thing only. Okay. So then we're going to go with barriers, facilities, no path. Um, let's go angle. Let's go with the three. No, it is um, on pause mode right now. Let's go in. Let's just... Um, let's also go to... Zoo, staff, hire a keeper, hire a caretaker, hire a vet. I'm not going to hire an educator and I'll hire a mechanic. But other than that, I don't think I need to hire anybody else. Okay. Um. Animal, common, warthog. Does not have enough hard shelter. Um. It is way more adequate than what needs to be, but that's okay. Um, so it does not have enough grass, short, um, or grass. It just needs a little bit of soil. So what we can do is, so let's go into terrain first. Let's get in. Let's 
So it needs no grass. It has way too much grass. It needs grass long. A train painting. Oh, maybe. Oh, it's not enough. Okay, it needs not have enough soil. Um, I'm going to give it more soil. More soil. Um, okay, and then what I'm going, what I'm doing is I'm going to add some. Let's go, and I'm going to add the tall grass along the back edge here sorry but having just a mixed up variety of that there um does not have hard shelter so it needs something for them to habitat so, okay, so let's look up beds and shelters. No. Um. Okay. I'm just kind of looking at all the different... Exhibit. So what I will do is let's put a let's put you over there. And that should give them some hard shelter. Now for navigationable area terrain plants um Africa so it looks like it needs some plants. So let's go nature. Let's go filter by biome first off. Um, grassland. Tropical.
continent Africa. Okay, let's not spend too much time on planting. Just to give them like a full head of shade here. Okay, I think that should be pretty good enough. No really good enrichments. So it's, it's got a lot of that. Um, what's nettle? N-E-T-T. -T. I'm going to throw some nettle around some of the, like, Just kind of place it like around the tree a little bit. But not like put air, put like couple of that there but rush river rush willow tree so it's got a, it's got enough coverage i think um not enough enrichments though so not enough enrichment so let's go Um, where are these guys? Are they? Okay, so enrichment, um, can we... Zoopedia. Okay. Um... General information. Um, hold on. So, do we gotta find the exhibit? No, that's exhibit trading. I don't want exhibit trading. Um, 
habitats, food and water, Can we filter this by species? What are these? These are the... Common. Ah. Uh, uh, So that we can do the common warthog. Um, we're going to go with a medium sized trough. Since there's not a lot of animals here at the moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have one set there. I have one way back over there. Water pipe, I think what I'll do is I'll put water pipe there. We're going to probably have, and then I'm going to probably put one way over there as well. So, okay, so these guys actually will take the wooden shelters over that that's probably why they're not going to be too happy but i think that should be okay okay there's no enrichment items for these guys but we do got our first thing here alerts research center i'm going to do the research center now And then so typically, typically you're supposed to hide these behind you, right? Okay, so we got that squared away. I'm going to try and use some of the nature from I'm going to kind of use a little bit of that there just to kind of hide the fact that there is any We're just kind of hiding it out back there. So that should help with not people wanting to see, I guess. Um, we don't really need the quarantine thing right now. Adopt exhibit species. Guess numbers and education. Okay. No, that's the trade center. I don't want the trade center. Where do I do zoo research?
Okay, so we do that there. Um, vet research. Okay, so let's try, let's get a couple of things here. Um, facilities, barriers, no. Planet Zoo wall lamp. So what I'm thinking what we do is we can... I know that you're so It's like, let's rotate that. Okay. Let's duplicate this. We're going to put it... So basically, all I'm doing is I'm putting lights where people are going to be intending. Do the advanced move. Okay, so that's gonna help with seeing, I guess, um, for them to be able to see. Okay. Instructional. Oh, I shouldn't have. Okay, so the reports are doing pretty good. We don't got a lot of people in here. Um, we're gonna, we're basically, we're just gonna use the common warthog as our main thing we know that they can be there so let's go facilities I'm gonna put that there finds a way so basically we're just gonna put those there um I'm going to put a couple of seat, a few bench seating there. Um, um, we're going to build a chief beef. Um, habitat educational stand.
giving them a little bit of that educational Oh, that's a, that educational board legs. Okay. Um, you know, board. Arg, I hate this. There's a common warthog. Oh, that requires power. Power. Move. Um. Do something like that. So at least now we have enough for people to come in and look at stuff. Okay, so I'm going to pause this now. So basically what we do is we've got a nice little thing going on here. Um, we kind of got a food thing there going on. Everything's there. Um... So, can I go to facilities? Do we have, like, blueprints? So what I'm going to kind of do is we do, is I'm going to build this kind of somewhat near the entrance here. No, let's, let's, let's do, let's go. And this is where we're kind of going to have something where we branch off. Or branch off. So we're going to do a pathing. Oh, and this is no wonder. Can we bring this down?
I don't like... I'm not a big, huge fan of some things. So this is like a little mini, a little mini walking area, I guess, for people. Um, I don't need to have that piece there. And I don't know. <laughs> I think that should be okay. I don't mind. I don't mind it being off by a little bit, but that at least now allows us to basically, we just spent like a whole bunch of money just trying to build that thing there. So we're ba banking on how that these guys and having that, we have zoo. So we got upgrade for the common warthog now. Um, animal training. Okay, stuff. Exhibit animal market. Red tailed tree frog. Amazonian giant centipede. Goliath beetle. No animals available in storage. Golden poison frog. I don't care, but I really just want to. I really want a red tail. A eyed tree frog, more likely. Breeding program. Um, OK, 
Okay, so that's the red tailed and the zoo there. Temperature's right, but the humidity... So we are decreasing the humidity in the... There. Um... We don't have power. So I don't know how I put that up there. <laughs> Probably two and three. So its humidity is 62%. Let's drop that down to 60. <laughs> 85 is okay. 85% humidity, 30 degrees Celsius. That ain't bad for them, so that that's definitely going to their welfare. So we got we got ourselves a little bit of people and exhibits so we got we got ourselves a few few things going for us um let's hope that we can actually survive off of this there's a reason why i haven't done the quarantine thing yet and i don't really need it right now
That's basically its transformer. Nope. Transformer basically sits up on top. Okay, the only other thing that I need to find is is guest facilities. Put a donation box there. Two thousand for a toilet block. So we got we got a little bit there. I think we can probably maybe get away by putting a donation box down here as well. Getting away by putting a donation box there. Because that'll at least allow for people to donate. People seeing that is a negativity. What we'll do is we'll work on um, loans. Okay. Zoo overview. Um. Efficient <laughs> funds to move this thing. Can I financial management? Active loans zero. How do I get finances? Loans. Because all I really want to take out is the cheap $5,000 loan. Just so that I can move that out of the way and then build build like a little bit of a path to it, but also like kind of hide it basically.
<laughs> oh, okay. So if it's coming from off there. Let's rotate. This is the last thing I'm going to place for today. I'm going to kind of... All I'm doing is basically just trying to hide the transformer. That's when we're out of people's sight and out of people's mind. But it's still sitting there, so it's still... And people still got some lighting, so... On the wall. Um, the only other thing is we're gonna need to have the... Um, facilities. We're gonna need to have... Okay, um, how do I, it's, rotate. Okay, putting that there. And then, basically, we're just going to put a vending. A vending there for Gulpy. So that if people need to buy something, they can. I know it might be a lot, lot less convenient, but there's not a lot here going on anyways. Okay, so they're thinking the ticket prices are... Overpriced. Okay. So we'll just drop it down then. So at least there's not a lot of people coming in. Coming in, but we uh, do got a fair bit of things coming in. We're okay, so. So yeah, so they're basically sitting there in their little nice little uh, view exhibit animal market. Um, let's go, let's try to do, like, another, let's do the Goliath Frog. Send a zoo there. The Goliath Frog.
Golden poisonous frog. We're gonna get rid of the red tailed frog as well. This, these two listings expired. And that, we're gonna send that one to that one. Seventy five there. Put about eighty three there. So now we have more people, more exhibits, I guess. So now what I'm thinking... Zoo has no security guard. Um, we'll hire just one security. Finances. So overview. I am only gonna charge a adult six kids. I'm gonna charge for three, just just to make a little bit of cash back. Just to see, just to see if we can. I'm only asking six. I'm not asking for more for adults. thirst the biggest thing is thirsty um can we go to finances can we go let's take that loan and pay that loan off it done Nice. Put a couple of gold machines down there. Just a couple. And I'll throw in a cup. And I'll throw a chief beef down in there. Uh -huh. There's no need for an info booth right now. Um, which is okay, I guess. Um, negative of facilities having specifically okay, so being able to see that is having a negative effect on them. So, Huh. 
Excellent. Are overpriced. So pads. For now, that's just going to be considered a staff path. Um, huh. Guess thing tickets are overpriced. Small barrel feeder. Um, okay, that should be okay. Um, I'm checking something real quick. Okay. Alright guys, that's going to be it. I don't know, um, this is episode one of starting our very first ever Planet Zoo franchise. Um, if you guys want to see dedicated, um, videos later down the line, um, just make sure you guys hit that like button. It really is greatly appreciated. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe. And we will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Probably. Whoa. Way past my bedtime. Okay. Gotta go. Bye.